What's up guys? Welcome back to your welcome back to another video and today guys we'll be working on my brother's project daily So we're not gonna call this project daily anymore because this is actually gonna be project paint <laughs> Because uh, we're gonna learn how to paint this car. I'm super stoked on it So you guys saw that we did a lot of the body work on the hood I think the hood for the most part is in pretty good shape We're gonna go ahead and try to do everything we need to do to get this thing painted I read you guys' comments. You're saying you need to put some acetone on. So I did a little bit of research on it. They're saying that you need to sand the whole car. And once you sand the whole car, you use some acetone before the primer and the paint and all that good stuff. So yeah, don't worry. I'm not going to forget about that step. We'll get to that point, hopefully. But there's a lot to do today. My goal today is to get this whole car sanded and bumpers and panels all off the car. So let's just get to it. And this is Noor cutting into the middle of the video in the future. So he's coming back to tell you guys that Carly is sponsoring this video. Is this straight? Yep. It's straight. So this is super sick, guys. So basically, I reached out. I, oh, you guys already know how much I love Carly. I lost my adapter when I was trying to sell my brother's F30 when I was selling the E46. I think I left my adapter in one of those two cars. So they really got hooked up. So I reached out to them to see if they could send me out another adapter. And they told me they have a brand new universal adapter. So I'm really hyped. I'm gonna open this up and just show you guys what's inside. But first off. See if I can do this one hand. You guys, check this out. I love this little uh, this little section they have here. It says, this is for you, the petrol heads, the enthusiasts, and the curious. Everyone who knows, like us, that a car is more than a uh, mode of transportation, to all of us, a car has a soul that embodies thousands of years of passion, engineering, and human creation. This is our fuel. <laughs> Why am I reading it like this? It's what keeps us gripped to our missions. We are Carly. We connect to what? you love okay i almost messed that one up but uh, basically check out this adapter even the quality is super nice a lot more compact this is universal it doesn't just work with bmws i like how the package is oh dear heavens i already nicked my brand new adapter i'll just reach out to him again <laughs> imagine imagine oh man this is not okay it's good if it survived this drop test then you guys know it's good and what i like about this this uh, adapter as well you don't need to buy this specific one for like iphone or android this works already with iphone android completely universal this is connected through uh bluetooth or wi-fi i think this was connected to bluetooth instead of wi-fi so that's pretty cool right now as of now i don't have any codes on the m3 so I, there's no really point of running it i'm gonna bring you i'm just gonna talk about the three top thing it diagnoses your car it gives you really really good information it's not like just a regular scanner it actually gives you like really specific good information which i really like you can do coding to your car custom coding rolling up windows you know certain blinking functions certain locking functions a whole bunch of cool stuff with the mirrors the windows that all can be done with this and all these service intervals no longer you take it to bmw if you got to get your your battery reset you got a new battery if you just got an oil change and you have an oil light or whatever it is you can just clear it with this you don't have to go to bmw for so anyways that that's all i wanted to say okay let's go back to the original video well uh, check out this janky stuff here there's no door handle here or here so how you open the door see i pull on this little guy right here there we go heard the door there Would you just take a look at this? What do you guys think? Is it a little more interesting than the car? I don't know, man. I kind of just wanted to stop in the video and ask you guys how you guys are doing. This is new in the future. Just want to see how you guys are doing. You know, is your day's going pretty good? Is uh, is this build, you know, as to your liking? You guys let me know down in the comments. Just let me know. If you guys are having um, an okay day, let me know down below. I want to talk to some of you guys. I think that's what I'm going to do down in the comments. So uh, if you guys have any questions for me or just, you know, Something's going on with your days. Let's talk down below. Hit the comments. I want to I want to hear you guys
so yeah guys we just found another super janky thing here so i was not expecting to see him that but uh whatever i guess they got the alignment on point because of it so let's just take that screw off and we're not putting that back Yeah. Oh yeah, what's going on guys? So um, basically, uh, show them the car. Show them what's going on with it so far. All the things have been removed. So, Nord just took off the rear bumper. We're repairing that for sand right before we paint it. And then we're gonna, what, what is it the step you do right before you paint, it's like mask? Uh, primer. Primer. We're gonna, we're gonna sand it, then primer. Sand first. Sand first. Then primer. And then we just took off these side skirts. We gotta find some more tabs. We did have some green tabs, but we found out that these don't fit. Uh, the regular ones so we need to go to like uh pick up some more of these and uh yeah th these things were held together by like one or two tabs so it was it was pretty, pretty janky. janky pretty janky Ain't gonna lie. took off the front bumper realized there were some made in china screws that were just shoved up there to keep it held tight and that was pretty nice you know that's a always comfortable feeling yeah <laughs> and then we also on the other side most of these are broken. They're just stuck on there. Just, uh, we need to take those out and get some new ones again. And it was the same thing like that. I mean, it is, it is honestly ready. Like, I want to get some acetone. It's ready for some paint. Like, honestly, we are we are ready for that next step. Um, Devon has the actual, um, so you guys are also saying to get sure you get a tank and a gun. We're not gonna use spray cans. So uh, my friend actually has like, a, I think a uh, 60 or 70 gallon. I don't know how, it's a really big tank. It's like this high. So, uh, However high this is, it's a pretty big gallon tank. All right, so we're gonna use that tank and we're gonna pick up some guns from Harbor Freight and we're just gonna actually go at this at the best of our ability. And we're gonna try to pick up some BMW paint. Um, so I know I told you guys to vote on the wrap. So now I'm gonna be saying paint. So if you guys would just, you know, I don't even know where to start. Paint has so many different colors, like three different layers. You guys let us know down in the comments what kind of paint you guys wanna see. But um, I wanna get this car in the middle of the, in the, middle of the street real quick and just show it to him. I think it'd be sick. You mean, Why? It should be a sick thumbnail too. It, it looked like Garbo. <laughs> exactly. Be okay, Let's perfect. Do Let's do it. Oh, so, so fresh and clean. I want this airbag. You guys, this airbag is me. They got the recall done on this one, so I want it on the M3. We'll swap it out once we get that. All right, all right. Check if there's any clips underneath the car when I pull you out. You got it. Yeah, just a bunch of clips. No screws though. Like Terminator or something, like the apocalyptic car. This shit's James. <laughs> it's so ugly. It's like an apocalyptic. What is that? Dude? I think though, we're good people. Like we'll never leave this kind of cars outside of the driveway. Like we'll get this car inside the garage. It's gonna take up the whole garage, but we're not gonna do it to the neighbors. So we're good people. Don't worry about that. So how I take my thumbnails? I use a phone. Not too difficult, you know what I mean? By the way, guys, the boxes are still in stock. I just want to let you guys know. I know I'm like. For me, you guys are seeing future Noir, past source Noir, all this stuff. I just want to let you guys know that the boxes are still for sale. I only I think I have like two or three left. So you guys absolutely killed it. I think the first 12 hours, we sold 20 boxes, which is absolutely insane. And then after that, I don't know what happened. But um, <laughs> just want to let you guys know that we only have two to three boxes left. So if you guys want to get a box, it's the, it's literally the last time I'm ever doing this. I'm doing free shipping, you know, pretty much 80 out the door flat, unless you're from Canada, because that's gonna cost me an initial like 20, 30 bucks to ship. So I'm charging a little bit for that. I'm not charging too much, but don't worry. But yeah, I'm not making a big profit on these boxes. Before. I think I'm making like $8 a box. So this is mostly for you guys to get this limited edition crate for me to support the channel. Just a little fun thing I did for the first time on my channel. I wanted to release a crate and you guys absolutely killed this there's only three left if you guys haven't got one check it out down below i mean guys just take a look at this the last time the first and the last time it's ever getting released on the channel so again only three left i'm about to mail all these out friday so once once these last three are sold they're never coming back it's just something i want to do on the channel for you guys for all the guys who've been asking what kind of mods should i get on my car this is it right here i'm making literally eight dollars a box or something like that so after all these are sold i'll make just enough to get you guys a spoiler for the giveaway and a little bit for me for the car so you guys can do the math you guys can pretty much see where i'm coming from here it's literally for you guys and i'm just i'm just happy to have released something like this i'm just happy that a lot of you guys 
wanted to get this. So yeah guys, one out of 25 of you guys are also gonna be winning a spoiler. This is basically to give back to you guys. So again, if you guys wanna enter the chance, one out of 25% chance, which I think is pretty good, one out of 25 chance, yeah. Make sure to check out down below, only three, that is it, completely limited, and you have a chance of winning a spoiler. This is for you guys. I thank y'all so much for 40K, and without further ado guys, I love y'all so much. Remember to stay humble, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Yeah, yeah, let's go. I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse. Man, it hurts. I'm on this earth with my words, and I put them all together in cert, cause I wanna have worth.